Hey, what's going on guys? XAlien7 here, and in today's video, I have just a few tips for you guys on how you can start a gaming channel on YouTube. So let's hop right on into it. Alrighty, so number one on the list is proper equipment. Now, being a gaming channel on YouTube, you're going to need the proper equipment. On YouTube, quality is such a huge huge thing you need good quality videos and you know to do this on consoles anyway you're going to need a capture card and you don't just want any old capture card now that the xbox one and playstation 4 are out you're going to want a capture card that supports 60 frames per second because you want to have the best quality possible guys it is a huge thing to have the best quality possible so my personal recommendation is the elgato game capture hd 60 um, records in perfect HD 60 frames per second, records on both Xbox One and PlayStation 4. So that is my recommendation to you guys for a capture card. Next, you're going to need a microphone. Yes, it is, it is important to have a microphone. No one wants to sit there and watch a YouTube video hearing this potato mic. It sounds like it's been in the microwave and it's, you know, like, god-awful. Like, no, no. You need a good microphone and you can get... A good microphone cheap, I have the Blue Snowball, I've had the Blue Snowball since I started YouTube, it is a great mic, it is a great beginner mic, you know, there is room to improve with the Blue Snowball, but it is great for starting out. And uh, I also forgot to mention the Game Capture um, HD60, I will have links down in the description to Amazon where you can purchase the stuff that I am mentioning, I am not sponsored in any way, I'm just, you know putting it there for you guys to have easy access to so for the game capture hd60 on amazon that goes for about around 180 dollars you can get it cheaper sometimes depending like their special deals like right now uh as i'm recording this it's for 150 dollars so you got to keep you know checking it out because you can get some good deals on it sometimes so anyway the blue snowball microphone um that goes from anywhere between 50 and 60 dollars you can on amazon anyway you could probably find it cheaper some other places but i'm posting those amazon links in the description below so make sure you check them out if you guys want to get the equipment that i have and what i'm recommending um so next off with your equipment you're going to need a good editing software you know you can have the best capture card and the best microphone in the world but if you know you don't edit your videos there's no point in having it so there's tons of different editing software out there one isn't necessarily better than the other um, but you, you want one that's easy for you to use oh, excuse me you want one that's easy for you to use and one that's you know simple enough for you to learn um, me personally I have Sony Vegas um, that's an expensive software so you know I wouldn't recommend that if you're just starting off I would recommend you uh, looking up some simpler ones to use and uh, easier ones to get so my personal recommendation is Sony Vegas but that's up to you guys but so for proper equipment you're gonna need a capture card no matter what and you want it to be HD 60 frames per second I can't stress to you guys how important that is you're going to need a microphone um, that's decent quality like I said I recommend the blue snowball because it's decent quality for a cheap price you can always get a better one like the blue yeti that's a mic that i want to upgrade to because it's a good mic good good quality microphone um but yeah you don't need that to start off with just get a, a blue snowball it's cheap and it's effective and then lastly you're going to need the editing software so uh number two on my list is be unique you know you want to have a unique personality in your videos um you know if i didn't give this intro to this video like a you know, I just gave you these tips and it was uploaded on someone else's channel. You know, I, it's, it'd be good. Like, obviously it wouldn't happen because I don't have that strong of an influence um, at this point. But it'd be good if someone could recognize, oh, hey, that's a so-and-so video. Like, you know, for instance, let's just say, and I know he's not partnering with them anymore. Let's say T. Martin posts a video on Machinima. And T. Martin doesn't give his intro in that video, but you know, I hear his voice talking. I, I understand the kind of videos T. Martin makes. I'm going to know that's a T. Martin video. So you want to be unique. You don't want to be a printed copy of someone else. Like, you know, now on YouTube, there's so many people who are, have channels and everything that, you know, you can't be exactly 100% unique because there's, there's so many people out there. But you don't want to sit there on YouTube, look at someone else's channel and be like, oh, okay, they made this video. I'm going to make that video because they did good doing that video. Like, you can't, you can't copy people on YouTube. Obviously, every video in the world's probably been on YouTube has probably been done twice over. Like, 
it's impossible to I wouldn't say impossible, but it's very difficult to come up with a 100% unique idea that no one's ever done before. That is something that's very difficult, so you gotta understand what I'm saying, like, and when I say be unique, you just, you know, you wanna, you wanna be unique. I don't really know how to describe it, like, uh, just be yourself. Don't, don't try and be someone you're not. I mean, if you're a grumpy person who no one likes, then yeah, try and be someone that you're not, but for the most part, be yourself, be unique, and you know, having a real relationship with your subscribers is, you know, it's a good feeling. So uh, next up on my list, number three, and my final tip is have value. A good question that you should ask yourself when any kind of channel on YouTube, not necessarily gaming. Um, a good question you should ask yourself is if I were a subscriber, why should I subscribe to you? You need to have value on your channel. Now, you know, I'm not talking about, you know, if I'm subscribed to you, you're going to give me a month of Xbox Live. No, 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 not like that. But value as far as, you know, are your videos going to benefit me in any way? Are you just, you know, making pointless videos just because you feel like making pointless videos? If, if you do, there's, you know, that's not a bad thing. But in order to gain subscribers, having value is a huge determining factor. Um, if you're going to be like, you know, if you're a tutorial channel and you're constantly teaching me stuff in video games that I didn't know how to do and you know because of your channel I now know how to do it your channel has value and I'm gonna subscribe to you because it it has meaning to me it, there's worth in there if you know your videos are absolutely hilarious and you know I every morning I go in my sub box and I see your video I click on it and you know it makes me laugh that has value to me so you need something along these lines of having value you can't just you know, this is something I've always struggled with and it's something I am now recently learning. You can't just, you know, sure, I feel like making this video, let's do it. I mean, it does work to some degree, but when you're starting a gaming channel, especially starting, these tips are, like, they're good. They're, they're going to come in handy. Having value is super important. So, that's it for the tips I have for this video. I'll just recap. Um, you're going to need proper equipment. I recommend the Elgato Game Capture HD60. $180 around there you can get it for cheaper 180 probably at the max Amazon link will be in the description down below next you're gonna need a blue snowball microphone again in the link there's the link in the description down below next you're gonna need to be unique and thirdly you're gonna have value that's it for this video guys hope you enjoyed these tips that I've given you remember to leave a like and a comment down below make sure to hit that subscribe button see you guys in my next video Hey, what's going on, guys? No, that's too much like Rockers Z Zoom.